Okay, in this problem, calculate the ratio of solidification time of two steel cylindrical risers of size 36 centimeter in diameter by 72 centimeter in height and 72 meter centimeter in diameter by 36 centimeter in height subjected to a identical condition of cooling. Identical condition of cooling means it having the same mole constant. The two risers, the one is a uh, One is uh, 36 centimeter in diameter, then height is equal to 72 centimeter. So the other one is other one is equal to uh, 36 uh, centimeter in height, and also the diameter is equal to 72 centimeter. Okay. Then let's see how to solve this uh, problem. Okay. Let's take the riser one. Riser one. Let's take this is the riser two. Okay, riser one and riser two. Let me draw the uh, sketch of the riser. Two risers. So one ha has the 36 in uh, this dimension is equal to 36 uh, centimeters. This height is equal to 72 centimeters. This height is uh, this length is equal to 72 centimeter. This height is equal to 36 centimeter. So then, uh, what is the total volume? Total volume is equal by r square into h. Uh, that is equal to uh, 5 18 square into 72 18 means the radius radius is equal to 18 that is divided by 2 that value is equal to 73287.073 cubic centimeters okay Cubic centimeters. Then what is the volume of this uh, riser 2? The volume of the riser 2 is equal to again the 5 r square into h. In this time the 5 is equal 5 r r is equal 36 36 square into again uh, 36. The total volume is equal you can calculate this value this is equal to 146,000 574.146 cubic centimeters cubic centimeters and if you calculate that area surface area that is equal to then how to calculate the surface area the 2 5 r is square 2 5 r is square 2 5 r is square plus 5 d h a is equal to 5 r what is r 18 into square plus 5 what is the diameter 36 what is the h 72 if you can calculate the a it will give 10,178.76 square centimeters square centimeters okay for this one, the total area, surface area of the riser 2 is equal to, again the same equation, 2 5 r square, 2 5 r square, plus uh, 5 d h, a is equal, 2 5, in this time r is equal 36, into square, 5 d, what is the diameter, 36, what is the height, 36. Oh, sorry, the diameter is equal to 72. Sorry, this one should be 72. Okay, 72. So, what is the value for the A? What is the value for the A? It will give us yeah, 
6.016 square centimeters. Then these values are given. These values are given. Then we can calculate. Uh, then we can use the the Torino's rule. Total solidification time is equal to cm v divided by surface area into mole constant. The mole constant uh, problem is asked to take the n is equal to sorry uh, exponent mole uh, exponent n is equal to two. Here this is the mole constant cm. Then uh, if you can apply these uh, values, the total solidification time for the riser one, the cm is an unknown value. The what is the total uh, volume? It's seven point zero seven three divided by a total surface area ten thousand hundred seventy eight point seven six into square. Okay, total solidification time and the cm this value. Uh, if you can simplify this value, we are getting. Fifty one point eight four. The equation one. Okay, equation one. If you apply the same equation, the uh, Torrens rule equations for this uh, casting, uh, this riser, by the value we are getting total solidification time is equal to cm same mole constant. So what is the total volume? One hundred four six thousand five hundred seventy four point one four six. In cubic uh, centimeters, and sixteen thousand two hundred and eighty-six point zero one six for the surface area into square. Total solidification time is equal to C M into what is the value we are getting? Eighty-one. Let's take this equation as equation two. Okay. Then uh, if we can uh, divide this equation one by two, then uh, we can get the ratio. We can get the ratio. I am going to divide the equation one. I am going to divide by equation two. Then we are getting total solidification time of a uh, riser one divided by total solidification time of riser two. So I will just uh, sketch the what is the shape of these uh, risers. The one hand the smaller diameter. And this one is the larger diameter one. You can see this uh, larger diameter having the higher uh, the CM that is equal to fifty one point eight four divided by same mole constant because the same mole material in the same uh, design. So eighty one. That is that will give the ratio zero point six four. Very. That means uh, solidification time. The ratio in between the solidification time in between these two is equal zero point six four uh, ratio. So that means this one having the greater solidification time compared to thinner thin cylinder. Okay.